Hi, Kent Larsen here. I just have a very basic video on how to parallel connect two speakers. Um, I've been uh, told that I have a tendency of making things a little bit too complex, so uh, I decided to make a very basic one uh, on this subject. How to parallel connect. And parallel connecting is something you do when you have two speaker drivers that you want to connect to one output of your amplifier. One warning to this is make sure that parallel connecting to the amplifier is something that the amplifier can do. Let me give you an example. If you have an amplifier that is able to go down to 4 ohms load, then you cannot get lower than that. That will be damaging to your amplifier. So if you have two 4 ohm speakers, do not connect in parallel, because that will create 2 ohms load, which is not good for your maximum 4 ohm amplifier. You don't want to go under that, but you can go higher than that. So we'll get back to the, that situation with serial connection. But this video, parallel connection, and that is typically when you have two 8 ohm speakers or 16 ohm speakers. And you have a fairly regular amplifier of 4 to 16 ohm load, and you want to connect the both of them to the same output. So let's do that. And so here we're connecting plus from the amplifier to plus on the first speaker. And then we connect from that plus to this plus like that. Then minus to the other lead right there, and from that same leg over to this speaker. This is now parallel. These speaker drivers here is each eight ohms. The amplifier, since it's going through both of them simultaneously, has a total load of 4 ohm. Because electrically, the current is running to, through two speaker drivers in parallel, so it has twice as much room, if you like, for the free electrons to flow. So that's why that you have now 4 ohms load. If, say physically, that this speaker driver was over here and it's not practical to connect it like that off to the next one, you could just go directly See if I can get this connected here. Like that. So plus over to here, like the both plus wires, out to both plus on the speaker drivers, both minuses from the amplifier, out to both minuses on the speaker drivers. This is the exact same, it still is a 4 ohm load from the two 8 ohm speakers. If these were 16 ohms each, you would have half again, just like before, so you will have a total of 8 ohms if you had 
16 ohms speaker drivers. This is parallel connection with speaker drivers. Kit Lazen here. Have fun with your projects out there. Bye. <laughs>